and in Russian fighter jets sound louder than the American ones? If you've ever heard Russia's Su-57 fly by, you don't forget it. It doesn't just thunder like most fighter jets, it screams, a piercing metallic wail that echoes through the sky. So distinct that people at air shows whip out their phones just to record that sound. But that howling roar isn't just noise, it's a lesson in how two superpowers think about war. Because when you listen to the Su-57, what you're actually hearing is Russia's entire engineering philosophy. Let's start with the basics. The Su-57 is powered by two massive Saturn AL 41F1 engines, brute force turbojets designed to prioritize raw thrust and maneuverability. To feed those beasts, Russian engineers gave the jet large straight air intakes that gulped down air with minimal restriction. Great for airflow, great for agility, terrible for stealth. Those open ducts expose the compressor blades directly to the outside world and to the human ear. Now, every jet engine makes sound. But in the Su-57, those compressor blades act almost like a siren. The rotating fans create pressure waves that shoot straight out of the intake, unfiltered and amplified by the twin nozzle exhausts. The result, that bone-rattling howl that's become the jet's signature. Compare that to an American F-22 Raptor or F-35 Lightning II. Both use carefully S-shaped air intakes, curved ducts that hide the engine's fan blades from radar and scatter sound waves before they escape. They're quieter, stealthier, and acoustically blurred. Even the exhaust nozzles are stealth optimized, flat, serrated, and designed to mix cool air with hot exhaust to reduce both infrared and acoustic signatures. Then there's how the jets fly. Russian fighters often rely on afterburners, massive bursts of raw fuel ignited in the exhaust to achieve their showy maneuvers. It's spectacular, but it's also deafening. American jets, built for stealth missions, avoid that whenever possible. So why does the Su-57 roar louder than the F-35? Because it's built to be seen and heard. The US builds ghosts, Russia builds gladiators. One rules the skies through silence, the other through sound. 